in this lesson unit 1 measurement and this measurement plays a very important role in our daily life how it plays a very important role if you buy the milk the milk we buy in liters if you go for some distance means it is measured in meter if you buy the vegetables means we will buy in the form of kg 1 kg potato 2 kg potato so likewise this measurement plays a very important role in our daily life and it was derived also physical quantities along with their units what is this physical quantity physical quantity is classified into two one is fundamental quantity another one is derived quantities so we can derive this also define this quantities which cannot be expressed in terms of any other physical quantities are called fundamental quantities example length mass time temperature etc quantities which can be expressed in terms of fundamental quantities are called derived quantities example area volume and density how can we express this derived quantity example area given no area means what we learn length into breadth volume means area into height okay and then units also followed with it what is the unit okay per one liter milk means that is the liter is the unit one kg potato means that kg is the unit one meter cloth so that meter is the unit likewise in the earlier times they have followed this length mass and time in cgs system fps system mks system cgs means centimeter gram second fpo means foot pound second mks means meter kilogram and second likewise the fundamental quantities and the units is also derived in the form of a symbols also length mass time temperature luminous intensity amount of substance and the units also given and the symbols also mentioned in our tabular column next what is this luminous intensity luminous intensity means that is a source of light if you light the candle or we are we have the light the source of the light is measured in the unit of candela next you see this derived quantities and they are units in this tabular column they have given the physical quantity how do we express this along with the unit i give one example for this area area expressed in the form of length into breadth what is the unit of length meter and breadth also meter so m into m meter square okay next force is defined as mass into acceleration mass means what is the unit kilogram acceleration means meter per second square so we can give the unit as kilogram meter per second square so likewise the physical quantity expressions and the unit are expressed here and along with this we can found the larger distance also like astronomical unit light year and parasite what is this astronomical unit the distance of the center of the sun from the center of the earth also measured the from the earth from the center of the earth to the center of the sun is the astronomical unit we can measure it in the form of astronomical unit and it is defined here next light year also can be calculated light year is the distance traveled by the light in one year in vacuum and it is equal to 9.46 into 10 power 15 meter next parasic the outer bodies of the solar system is also measured in this unit as parasic outer bodies of the solar system la parasic and our unit la panna measure pannala parasic is a unit of distance used to measure astronomical objects outside the solar system so one parasic equal to 3.26 light year and larger units and the smaller units is also measured here in the form of kilometer astronomical unit parasite fermi angstrom nanometer micron millimeter centimeter 
they are in the in our tabular column also so thank you